Via Hero Day. This is L, ang inyong ka YouTube kabayan dito sa Hong Kong. I'm going to share with you some tips on how to go from the Hong Kong International Airport to your temporary place of residence while you are here in Hong Kong. Minsan nakakalito kasi isipin mo, ano ba, magtitrain ba ako, magbabas ba ako, paano ba ako pupunta sa hotel o sa kaibigan ko. So, I hope this video can help you go about the transport means to go to your residence here. Okay, see you! Please watch this video! <laughs> Ang dami kong ka! Collecting your luggage from the baggage carousel, you can choose to exit from Arrivals Hall A or Arrivals Hall B. We are in Hall B. As you go out, you will be welcomed by the Hong Kong Tourism Board booth. Here you can get some brochures or get tourist information. Wi-Fi is free at the airport, but in case you cannot connect to the internet, Check out this courtesy phone inside the arrivals hall. So I just dialed a mobile number of my son using this phone and it is for free. So when you arrive here in Hong Kong, you can use this phone to call anybody in Hong Kong with a Hong Kong number to pick you up, to help you or what So this is a free phone. That's why it's a courtesy phone. You know, in the past, there used to be a slot here where you will put one Hong Kong dollar to be able to call. But now, it's free. Right? It's free. Anything free is good, right? Okay. As you exit Hall B, you will be welcomed by greeters. Normally, your family or friends who will fetch you at the airport will tell you at which arrival hall to meet. If you're worried that you might be in the wrong arrival hall, take it easy because there are monitors for both halls showing the greeters where the arriving passengers are. Have a look! Let's leave Hall B and go to Arrivals Hall A. See, it looks the same! The fastest link from the airport to the central business hub is the airport express train. The travel time takes as little as 24 minutes for that 35 kilometer journey. If you have decided to ride a train, you need to buy a smart ticket or an octopus card. This is one of the counters in the airport where you can inquire and buy the octopus card. Alternatively, you can go to this automated kiosk to buy train tickets. But I suggest that instead of buying single journey tickets, you may want to consider buying an octopus card. You will save some money too. Here's why. A single journey smart ticket is 115 Hong Kong dollars, but if you buy the same ticket using an octopus card, it is only 110. Sometimes, there are seasonal promotions too when you ride the Airport Express. So if you're a value seeker like me, better ask the counter personnel so you won't miss them. So now, we are at the airport. Then you will travel by Airport Express going to Hong Kong. There! It's Hong Kong or the Central Station. So Hong Kong is the end of the line for the Airport Express and it is also the start of the line going to the other routes in the MTR 
network. So when you arrive in Hong Kong using your octopus card and you want to go to Wan Chai, the fare from Central to Wan Chai is zero. So it's free. If you use an octopus card in buying your fare ticket from the airport to Hong Kong. So this map shows you the different points that you can drop off from the airport using the airport express. So there is Ching Yi and then Kowloon and then the farthest is Hong Kong Station. Let's now walk to the airport station where you can ride the train. Notice that we reach the platform without presenting our ticket or tapping the octopus card. This is because you can do that at your destination station. Let's see the inside of the train. This seats are arranged in opposite directions. If you get dizzy easily like me, better position yourself facing the onward direction. See you in the Hong Kong station! We are now at the Hong Kong station. This is the farthest station of the airport express. So, after you take the ride, you will go out of the station. If you bought your ticket at the airport, you will just have to tap your ticket here or your octopus here. But in case you miss to buy your ticket, you can still buy it at that counter. There, see? She's going to buy it so that she can get out of this turnstile. If you're planning to get into a taxi after your airport express train ride, across the exit from the trains are the taxi stands. If you are taking an Uber ride or a pre-booked taxi that will pick you up from the Hong Kong Airport Express train station, Go to the ground floor and out to the drop-off area. If you want to ride the local train from the Airport Express station, take this elevator, one level down, and voila! You are now at the entrance of the MTR train network. If your destination is in the Hong Kong Island line, follow me! central station platform which links to the different lines in the MTR network system. You can practically go to different parts of Hong Kong from here. Thanks for watching! If you're new to my channel and you like this video, please like, subscribe, and leave a comment so I can improve my future videos. 
Have a great adventure!